In this video, you'll learn how to calculate the average rate of change of a function between two points from a graph or from a table. You will learn to find the average rate of change for a linear, quadratic, and an exponential function. Remember, the average rate of change is always the difference between the y values over the difference between the x values. Let's start by looking at a function shown in a table. Consider the function shown in the table below. What is the average rate of change between x equals negative 1 and x equals 5? You want to find the average rate of change between x equals negative 1 and x equals 5 for the function. First, record the corresponding ordered pairs, negative 1, 3, and 5, 51. Call one point x sub 1, f of x sub 1, and the other point x sub 2, f of x sub 2. As mentioned, the average rate of change is the difference of the y values divided by the difference between the x values. You can write this as f of x sub 2 minus f of x sub 1 all over x sub 2 minus x sub 1. Substitute to write 51 minus 3 all over 5 minus negative 1. Subtract in the numerator and denominator to get 48 over 6. Simplify the fraction to get 8. Therefore, the average rate of change for the given interval is 8. Now look at the second problem, which is a quadratic equation. Consider the graph of the function below. What is the average rate of change between x equals 0 and x equals 5? Here the y value of x equals 0 is minus 2 and the y value of x equals 5 is 3. Using the formula you just learned, you can calculate the average rate of change. Here, the average rate of change is 3 minus negative 2 divided by 5 minus 0. The result is 5 divided by 5, which is 1. There is also another way to calculate the average rate of change from a graph. Count the units between y equals negative 2 and y equals 3. There are 5 units. Similarly, there are 5 units between x equals 0 and x equals 5. Therefore, the average rate of change is 5 divided by 5, which is 1. The third problem is an example of an exponential function. Consider the graph of the function below. What is the average rate of change between x equals 0 and x equals 2? Here, the y value at x equals 0 is 0, and the y value at x equals 2 is 3. First, using the formula, you can calculate the average rate of change. Here, the average rate of change is 3 minus 0 divided by 2 minus 0. The result is 3 over 2. There is also another way to calculate the average rate of change from a graph. Count the units between y equals 0 and y equals 3. There are 3 units. Similarly, there are 2 units between x equals 0 and x equals 2. Therefore, the average rate of change is 3 halves. Now you know how to calculate the average rate of change of a function between two points, from a graph or from a table. See you next time.